Occasionally I get the question, there's so much information on your website, where do I start? Where do I start with getting my rig optimized? So let's go over some steps. While I do have a video that I filmed quite some time ago on the basic setup steps involved in optimization, um, it worth, it's worth repeating and perhaps even updating a little bit here. So. Well, you got to start with a vertical tracking force scale. We don't sell those, but I've talked about them on some of my videos, um, made some recommendations. Got to have a good tracking force scale. Then the two basic Wally tools are the Wally tractor and the Wally skater. Absolute basics. Get used to those. Get used to managing your torque force in your arm and static friction with the um, Wally skater and then of course uh, with the Wally tractor proper horizontal alignment of your stylus cantilever assembly. Following that you might want to play around with the Wally reference to get an idea of where your head shell is at relative to the record surface or jump straight to sending the cartridge to us for analysis. This is this is the best of all possible worlds because then we can know everything that there is to know about your cartridge all the four angles the channel separation and so forth and uh and then from there you can employ the necessary tools like the wally reference and if you've got zenith error 81.7 percent chance you do and it's audible uh, uh then the wally zenith the wally scope when people call me about the wally scope my first reaction is try to talk them out of it <laughs> um I tell them, look, for one third the cost of a Wally scope, you can send me the cartridge for analysis and we'll know a lot more about the cartridge than the Wally scope will tell us. Um, but there are some people who want to own it, they think it's cool, they've got lots of cartridges they want to take a close look at, do the stylus inspection and so forth, and that's fine. But um, it's, it's, not, it's not an every man's tool, that's for sure. Spend some time watching the many educational videos on our website or on our YouTube channel. I'm really sure that it, if you put in the effort to do that, um, things will be coming into, come into focus for you. You'll be able to see the path forward for yourself. What makes most sense for you, for your rig, given your level of patience, dexterity, and, um, and the amount of money you're willing to commit to the effort. If there's ever any questions, reach out to me and uh, be happy to respond to your questions. So until next week, on the next Soundbite video, see you then.